Here's your 50 gold pieces for me and I'll hold your gold until you get back get out and meet you on the other side. Good luck. With a firm boot to your backside, Lionel sends you tumbling through the trap door. I got all my health back. Although it's actually an event, so I have to avoid traps. No doubt. <laughs> Great. Ooh. Oh, it's one of these. I've done these before. So whether or not I can actually make it through, I'm not getting fucked. Oh. oh my god, that was close. I don't pay attention. And that is my problem. Yeah, it's th this whole shoot. You just dodge over them. These ones are fairly simple. Dooby dooby doo. I just don't trust anything. Stop. Oh god. Oh dear. <gasps> oh no. I pressed the fucking dodge button. Game, god damn it. I don't know if that counts if you run into it. Probably does. Oh dear. Oh. What the fuck? Oh, we made it. Aha. I lost six gold again. I'm losing all my money. I don't get it. Whatever. Mr. Lionel immediately greets you upon your escape, lifting your bag of gold before you even realize he is there. He counts out the coins you managed to retrieve. Hmm, not nearly enough. I want my revenge. Get back in there and get me my gold. Mr. Lionel watches you expectantly. Go back into the maze? I got all my health back. With a deep breath, you turn and go back into the maze of golden traps. Fuck's sake. This better not be worse than it was before. I don't know if my food's going down. I mean, it might be. And if it is, then shit. That ain't good. The trap is this. Oh no, isn't the same. Whoosh. Okay. Okay. What on earth? Wait, am I going to be, like, grabbing gold? Shit. Oh, I am. I never knew that. I didn't know there was gold just laid about the place. He wants 50 gold pieces. Whoa. That was almost really bad. Yeah, I had no idea there was gold just on the floor. Shit. Right. I like how the vases don't even get destroyed. They're just kind of <laughs> there. Oh, this is still not going to give me enough. How the balls do I do this? Oh, oh. I got 18 gold that time. Even if that's not enough, I'm not doing it again. Actually, I kind of have to, wouldn't I? And I lost 7 gold. Yeah, I'm leaving. You turn on board before Mr. Lionel convinces you to risk your life again. Yeah, I don't get the token because I didn't get enough gold, but I don't care. Um, maybe I can do that when I don't have the... Whatever the hell the curse is, because that's making me lose gold all the time. For no reason. I, I don't understand it. I really don't. I know it's a curse. I don't know why I'm losing gold all the time, though. But whatever. Hey, calling the Ratman. Our nice. Lives are often lived thus, are they not? All the lands in the kingdom are being overrun with Ratman. Merchants in my lands are attacked on the road, as are any travellers such as yourself. My god. I would. I'd go for them, but I don't have 50 gold. Would hire a mercenary army to find their nests and call their numbers. Shit. I understand that contributing to the common good may be unfamiliar to your sort, but I urge you to return immediately if you change your mind. I don't have any money. I thought I could just go and kill them for him, but apparently not. Travelling mage. No, I have li literally no money. I'm using up way too much food here, I've just realised. Killing their leader is a fine way to provoke them. Six of them again. 
Great. This is good. And the way that this game is going to work is that if I do uh, end up losing on one of the encounters or one of the um, like rounds, then I'm not going to cut it out because the game works that it's different every time, so that's fine by me. Oh, I'm fucking poisoned. Oh no, I thought I was, but I'm not. That I'm glad of. I just can't see when they're attacking now because I don't have a shield. So I've just got to guess. Oh, that makes things extra annoying with the ranged dudes. Yeah. I'll just have to keep slashing away, I guess. Keep going! Oh dear. I got the other one. Yes! Okay, that wasn't so bad. I probably lost all my gold, but that wasn't so bad. Yeah, I lost six. I don't get it. I just don't get it. Okay, I gained three food. Nice. Fuck, it's in that top corner. Oh no, it isn't. Yes. A horse is a fine I could have left this level straight away. Hit your ride. The temperament for friends, even in the animal kingdom. Wow, you're a dick. What brings you to play the game? To play the game. I know you will not tell me, like all the rest. You are silent. Of course. What is this? The crucible. A crucible to heat and purify the flawed metal. The town of Stiegel sits upon the only safe crossing of the river Ernst. However, the only adventurers allowed to cross are those who pass through the crucible. In the crucible, you'll find monsters for the entertainment of townspeople of Stiegel. What will you do? I'll enter the crucible. You are led to the first arena. Choose your opponent wisely, as a man from the crowd. I'm betting on you. Shit. Ooh, I get to choose. Skulls. They're a hell of a lot easier than anything else. I fucking wish I had a shield. I need a shield. But I lost my shield. And I've already passed by Mr. Lionel. Shit. That's one good thing about Mr. Lionel. If you lose your shield, you can find Mr. Lionel to get your shield back. Balls are Rooney. Oh well. Oh god. What the fuck? Whoosh! Have my frozen dust. Jesus. What is with the spikes? I don't quite understand. Either way, that was a lot easier. Yay! And I lost all my money. Even though I lost no health. You survived that round, now do it again. The crowd awaits your decision. Six of dust. Six of dust. Yes. I don't care. Anything's better than plague. Anything is better than the, the plague. I hate the plague. Oh, I thought I'd missed. Oh god. It's like they slow down when they're attacking, so it's fine. Although some of them are using ranged attacks. Which I realize. Fuck's sake. It's these dickheads. Jesus. Oh, the spikes come out everywhere. I'd rather stay in the shield then. Wow, that was stupid. Either way, they all died. Quite easily. The only thing that really took my health down so much was the, um... The knife throwing guys. Awesome! After surviving the crucible, you've paraded through the town and allowed to continue upon your adventure. A few random peasants throw coins saying, you've made me rich, warrior. The other draws you four gold gain cards. And I also get the token. So I've got 20 gold, 15 gold, another 15 gold, 
And another 15. I've got 65 gold. Not bad. That will all be gone if I go into any more combat. Local peasant. Hungry mouths. War leaves nothing else. I meet a peasant woman. Great stranger, the winter has been hard on our family. Ah, oh, great. In the forest behind her, you sense movement. Oh, fuck. I could give her two food. But that might fucking, like, screw me. Only giving her one will definitely fuck me over. I can't give her five. Well, I could. I don't want to. I'll go with two. Don't want to take your food eagerly, passing it to some children who suddenly rush from the forest, hands outstretched. While well, children eat, the woman speaks at length of what she has seen and heard recently. Ah! Ooh! Ooh! That's the White Council, hunting the Huntsman. What the fuck? Where's the exit? That's Devil's Carnival. Something Mouth. Cave Mouth. Where is the exit? Travelling Healer. Okay. Oh, they don't get turned back down. Oh, my bad. In that case, I'm off over here because I want to do these. While resting at the end of a small town, you are suddenly accosted by a young man. You, it's all your fault. You've doomed the village of Dimsgate. Oh, listen to his woes. It's because I killed some of the White Council's people. The White Council thinks that we paid you to attack their men in retribution. They have plagued our, our town with the undead. One day, a group of mages appeared out of nowhere and laid a curse on the town. Some men, my father included, tried to stop them. But it was hopeless. Their magical shields blocked every blow. And then they conjured a hail of enchanted arrows that pierced our men through flesh, bone, and organ. Ouch. We had to abandon our village. Even now, a horde of living dead keeps us from returning. Offer to help. And so you should. You can start by returning to our village and clearing out the undead. Their numbers seem to be limitless. Oh dear. Return to Doomsgate. Wait, is that what that t changed that to? It did. That was the hunting the huntsman. Fuck it. Or hunting the something. <laughs> you return to the village of Lesser Dimsgate, now cursed by the White Council. The eerie silence lies heavily upon you as you walk in the deserted streets. The town square, you discover a pair of unusual totems. They are made of bone and glow with an unnatural energy. Their unliving bones of fallen visit villagers walk the earth in silent vigil around them. Oh no. A few weapons scattered on the ground speak of previous failed attempts to free the village of from the undead invasion. I'll attack them, there's only four. The living dead turn towards you as one. Turn towards you as one as you approach. Weapon in hand. That? What? Is it just me that made no sense to? Or maybe I read it wrong? Pretty sure I didn't, but that, that made no sense. I, I know that much. Oh no! Four of skulls! Whatever will I do? These are actually starting to take a long time. It's been half an hour. Is that a lot of gold? Ah, the totems. Use my ability. I should probably attack the totems, honestly. Unless it just means I'll always go against four. Ah, oh, that's hard. Excuse me. Coming through. That was easy. They block everything. Are you kidding me? No! Okay, they don't block everything. They block a few things. Whoosh! Yes! I'll just deal with this one. Oh, damn. I win. And I dealt with the totems, too. So that was a uh, double win. <laughs> His chest stood up right at the end. Brilliant. I lost six gold. Fuck it. Later that day, the villagers learn of your efforts and begin returning to bury their dead. 
You've done nothing, stranger, yells an old woman as she brags, drags a sack of bones towards the village cemetery. Those robed devils will be back again when they hear of this. Next time they'll probably blast this entire village off the face of the earth. You've doomed us all. Don't mind her, young girl says she's always cranky. Thank you for laying our fallen to rest. She has a point though. They're probably going to come and kill us all unless you can stop them. Consultation. Oh my god, this is so fucking... This is just leading one after another right now. Holy crap. Consultation. I never saw that coming. My Again, goodness. Is at stake. I know this. Holy crap. You sit at the table of the mayor of Lesser Dimsgate one evening discussing...